What's going on, his squad? This your main man, Hitman, and I am late with the video. I'm back once again <laughs> with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all lost jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Monday, November 15th, and as I say each and every video, make sure you guys like, share, subscribe. Turn on all post notifications so you can get each and every video that I put out because I I try to put out videos each and every day. I try. Um, today I, I I was really tired and I guess it caught up with me and I overslept my alarm to get ready for the video and stuff like that. So, um, anywho, let's get down to business. I'm gonna try to make this a quick video. <laughs> First things first is Madame Nazara's location, which I'm sure I went to her, which she didn't change spots from yesterday. So she should still have been on your map if you did go to her. Um, my quickest way, as I said yesterday, just put your camp down in Rio Bravo and run to her from there because it's quicker than traveling from Tumbleweed or Armadillo. Either, wherever you put it, you can get spots even super close to her like right next to her so you know just place your camp down in rio bravo and run to her from there she will be here until 1 a.m that's eastern standard time new york time zone east coast time zone for those of you who don't know or not of america uh the next thing i want to get to is the caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle which today that's up near the word window rock that's right above Cumberland Forest and right outside of Valentine. Just run up to this location, go inside this shack where this waypoint is, go through the door and to your left. I think on the table, that's where the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle is for today, right here at this location. Uh, let's get down to, you know, the nitty gritty. I don't know why I wanted to say that, but <laughs> let's get down to, you know, the normal situation let's get down to these cycles the cycles for today monday november 15th are family heirloom cycle four all luxury cycle six coin cycle five arrowhead cycle one wildflower cycle five antique alcohol bottle cycle three all tear card cycle two bird egg cycle two and fossils cycle five as I said, remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there for you guys. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter, Instagram, Facebook and cash out for the channel. Um, I left this here so you guys can see the markers just in case you do want to follow along or, you know, mark things on your map. So you, you can go find it on your own, but I'm gonna tell you what they are real quick, starting with the marker all the way up here above this elimination series, and that's above Blue Water Marsh. Right here at this location, right below, right below this triangle here, it's about right here, really. Right here at this location, if you guys can see that triangle there, you guys will get a random coin i cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized go right between the clothesline with your metal detector pull out your metal detector and that's what you will dig up a random coin i have a mark well uh, item inside this house this is a antique alcohol bottle it's an old time gin antique alcohol bottle it's in the sink cupboard that's right below the sink there's a little cabinet area I open that and you will see a old time gen antique alcohol bottle let's go down to our next marker which is between the m and a of marsh right here at this location pull out your metal detector once again and you will get a random fossil i cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized uh let's go down a little bit where there are some things that i did not mark or i could not mark because i ran out of markers right here pull out your metal detector once again at this location right next to the word lagrange and you guys will get a random lost jury. I cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized. This is a uh, spot where you dig it. So pull out your metal detector right here and come to this location, this exact location. And that's what you will get a random lost jury. If you do look across while you are standing there on this bench on a one of the dock posts, you guys will get 
which is not right here it's kind of like over a little bit like right here it's kind of in the middle but this is a six of swords tarot card if we do want to come over here and grab that uh let's go over here just down just a little bit more or should we go over here first right over here across the Kamasa river if you do want to cross come to this location right here and you guys will get another random coin i cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized i mean exactly what coin you will get but it is randomized come right here to this location with your metal detector and that's what you will dig up uh i put the marker right here but it's super close to this square because the square is like a moonshine camp so you have to kind of step like right at the edge of that moonshine camp and you still like inside it basically but that's what you will get a random coin stand right there at the location and pull out your metal detector and that's what you will get right here there are a cl cluster of things which i did not have markers to mark but right next to the word locate in this l-shaped shack right at the back there's a family heirloom this family heirloom is on a bench this is really simple to get just go through the shack go all the way to the back and that's what you can grab a goat hairbrush there's also a random lost jewelry right about here right here at this location there's a a skull altar which is basically a stack of skulls on a stick Right here at this location, pull out your metal detector near that skull altar, and that's what you will dig up. A random lost jury. Also, inside this little shack, or whatever you want to call it, there's a four of wands on the table inside, so go and grab that as well. Let's continue. I was going to go this way, but there's not much that way. But let's go down here to the end of NWA. Right here at this location, there's two items inside this house I wanted to tell you guys about. One is an antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is an Irish whiskey bottle. It's inside the house on the table. You may think like, okay, it's a house. There's a bunch of tables. Be more specific. If you actually pay attention to the house, there's only one table inside the house. Actual tables. There's a lot, lot of places to sit things, but there's one actual table. <laughs> the other item that's inside this house is on the fireplace it's on the mantle of the fireplace this item is a durant pearl bracelet so remember to go get that well it's a lost jury and it's a durant pearl bracelet remember to go get that um right about here there's a tarot card on a barrel this tarot card is a eight of pentacles go and grab that and right here at this next marker that's right above the e of lemoyne and right outside the the mayor's or governor's mansion right here underneath this bridge pull out your metal detector once again you will get another random coin i cannot tell you what it is because they've randomized everything <laughs> let's go over here to the cemetery right here at this location you guys will get a tarot card this tarot card is a knight of wands it's right here at this location go and grab that too uh right by the d in the knees there's another uh marker and this marker is a ivory hairpin. This ivory hairpin is right on the other side of this brick wall. There's a little gate right here where this marker is. Go through that gate and you should see a table. And on that table, you guys will find the ivory hairpin. Let's go down to our next location, which this is another location that I did not mark. Inside this backyard, there's patio furniture white patio furniture there's tables and all that stuff like you know chairs you know plastic stuff look like <laughs> right here at this location on the table you guys will get a cherry wood comb it's on the patio furniture in the backyard remember to grab that right here at our next marker uh come over here to this location there's a very large tree in this backyard go to the large tree and pull out your metal detector you guys will get a random lost jury i cannot tell you what one you will actually get because it is randomized the next thing go across or you can come down here and grab this one first but we're going to go over here before we get to that because I, I like to say the cardinal flowers last right here at this location you guys will get a bird egg of this marker right here across the water uh, you, this is a spoonbill egg. This spoonbill egg is in a tree. Shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow. 
using a small game arrow. Across the water, where we kind of started it, on this little island right here, you guys can get a cardinal flower. This cardinal flower spawns over here in this area each and every day and by its exact location, it tells me what cycle the flowers are on for the day and today is cycle five. Um, there's a couple random things like down here in this area, like right about here, there's a arrowhead. If you guys do want to come over here, this is a dig spot. You do not need your metal detector, but that right here at this waypoint is a random arrowhead. Uh, there's a antique alcohol bottle inside this house. This antique alcohol bottle is a Tennessee whiskey bottle. It's in the cabinet in the living room if you want to go grab that. Next to Anthony Foreman's or this stranger's house, uh, there's a tree. Pull out your metal detector right near that tree and you guys will hit on a random coin. Up here at the Braithwaite Manor home, there's a family heirloom. This family heirloom is on the second floor. It is on top of the fireplace, second floor, first room to the left. And this item is a family heirloom, which is a jade hairpin. I have a couple things for you guys in Roach, which is basically two cards. And that's it for this whole little area right here. But one tear card is on the terrace of this saloon. If you guys can see the saloon over to the left, go to the back right here at this area. There's a stairway. Go up the stairway and you will see like a whole little dining area. This is the terrace. On one of those tables, you guys will get a Knight of Swords tarot card. So go and grab that as well. Um, right here at this barn, there's a bench right in front of it. And on that bench, you guys will get another tarot card, which is a Four of Cups. Let's go up to a next location right below the word Southfield. And right next to Flats, to see this peak or this line right here? Right at the peak of it, there's a Scarecrow. Go in front of that scarecrow with your metal detector and you guys will get a random lost jury. I cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized. Let's go over and get all the way over here. Skip past our marker. Inside this home here, you guys will get a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a goat. It's not a goat or a goat. And it's a New Guinea rosewood hairbrush. This New Guinea rosewood hairbrush is a family heirloom. It's in the chest in one of the bedrooms, which is like a treasure chest, a pirate's chest in one of the bedrooms. So go and grab that. Uh, right over here ne near Matic Pond or right at or outside of Matic Pond, there's two things actually. One thing is a arrowhead. This arrowhead sits about right here at this loca location. You do not need your metal detector for this one. You just need your shovel. So when you do dig that, that's what you will dig up, a random arrowhead. But if you do pull out your metal detector right about here, you guys will get a random item. I cannot tell you what it is, what category, what you will dig up or anything like that. It's random. So anything you can dig for, I think maybe some things that you can't or not supposed to dig for. I don't know exactly 100% how it works, but there's a random item right here. If you do pull out your metal detector, so go and grab that as well. Uh, that's pretty much it for all the extras and everything I have for you guys. I'm going to try to put everything in frame so you can see um, and go about your journey trying to find everything. The cycles for today, Monday, November 15th, once again are... Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Laws Jury Cycle 6, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 3, All Terror Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 2, and Fossil Cycle 5. Remember to check the description box below because everything is down there. The cycles are linked to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and cash out for the channel just in case you do want to keep up and or donate in any type of way if you do i super super appreciate it <laughs> it, it is, i, I want to let you guys know thank you for watching looking listening liking sharing subscribing commenting and everything else you do do for the channel i do appreciate it so so much and if you haven't if you don't remember to like share subscribe turn on all post notifications so you can get it each and every video that i put out when i put it out it's your main man hitman once again with another video I'm out.